at Emma's Florist on West End. Helium is a hot commodity. If um, I can just order like um, the two of these. That's because here they have helium. But many party stores, like this one in Cool Springs, as the sign says, are out. I actually came in to buy um, helium balloons for my son's 16th birthday and found out that there's a helium shortage. Who knew? Okay. Helium is extracted from underground. It takes millions of years of decay involving rock and other materials to make. And scientists say we're simply using it faster than the earth can replenish it. The price has gone up just a little bit, but I've tried to keep the price to the consumer the same. While balloons may be where you notice the shortage first, where it really matters is in the medical field. <laughs> Helium in its liquid form is used to cool MRI machines. Well, right now, there's a very uh, rapid increase in the use of MRI machines. Uh, there's um, a lot of uh, develop developing countries that are using more MRI machines. At Vanderbilt, scientists have improved ways to recycle what they have, a practice this radiology professor says we need more of across the board. Fire. Because helium is also used to make rocket fuel, even flat screen TVs. Some scientists predict we'll run out by the year 2050. I am concerned, but again, I, I'm a believer that we're going to be able to develop the technology that allows us to uh, conserve and uh, maintain what, what we got. Only time and consumption will tell, but if it comes to pass, this florist has a backup plan. I guess we'll have to sell more roses.